Huh? Stop right there, criminal scum! This video is not made for children. If you're under age 13 or younger, please, for the love of Christ, live at once, or you will be judged! Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another review, but this time, we're gonna be reviewing another Treasure X. Yes. Now, today I went to my local HEB. I went to find a they need, they got, um, the Earthrise real wheeljack figure. Unfortunately, they, they don't have it, so. And also, I checked the DC, um, Pixar cars. Sadly, they don't have it. So, anyways, so if you guys remember, I made a review on the Treasure X Series 4, 5 versus Ice, which is this one. I, I made a review of Eyesore. If you want to go right ahead, if you're on your computer, go to the uh, mid end video to check it out all the way to the outro. Or if you're on your phone, go to the information symbol up there to check it out. So, I'm going to review another Treasure X Series 4, but also, I also bought something more than that. I also bought these more Hot Wheels color shifters, but these will be in a separate video on these two. So, yeah. But we're going to focus on, on, on this one. So, this one is the Hunter Pack. So if you guys remember, Treasure X are are made from moose. They are mystery toys, and will you find real gold treasure? So yeah. Now before I'm gonna continue to continue with this, please make sure to subscribe and then punch the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell to see more videos that I upload. And also I forgot to mention one thing in my last video on my yes the video what I did on my channel. I do have Patreon, but I actually don't know how to use it. But if you guys can, like, you know, donate a dollar if you want to. If not, just follow me on Patreon. Doesn't matter. I will. I will put some photos of custom paint figures that I already working on, that I already finished. Then I'll have the list of everything what you need. Then I'll probably leave the link to this, the link of the video that I'm gonna do. So we have the Hunter Pack, of course. Here it is, what it looks like in the front. Here's the side of the packaging. 1800 to collect. Will you find fire or ice? And here is the 10 level of Avengers. Remove the tool. Discovery quest, everything, yeah. I already have my own my own map of it, so yeah. So now if you guys are new for Treasure X, all what you need is some a plate. This kind of plate. The last time I did I used I had to use two plates, gloves and some exacto knife. So I'm gonna put the gloves on because the wax of it smells so bad god that's so disgusting so I'm gonna put my gloves on because I don't want to get the smell of that nasty ass wax and also some fellow youtubers from the who reviewed treasure X are finally getting the new series 5 well I know moose toys sending them and I understand that but hopefully I could get one of the new series 5 sunk in gold so yeah so my main goal is to find gold crown or X's and finding the two gold crown that I need. And probably that's it. Yeah, that probably that's it. So gold crown or X's or one of the two ultra rare gold to treasure. So yeah. I'm gonna get my sacto knife out. So the last time I got ice sore, so I got the ice, so hopefully if I get a fire one, then hopefully I can get a gold as well and also remember do not play with the exacto knife if you're stupid enough to play exacto knife you're stupid and you're and you already screwed yourself so don't play exacto knife I forgot to mention one thing this is not made for kids all right so I'm gonna pause the video right now because I need to lay down because I need to like you know lie down while recording this so yeah all right, I'll be right back let's unbox this thing so the tape is, this tape is right over there. I know this is going to be a long video, but I don't care. I really don't care. I'm just like extremely tired. It's hot here in Houston. Like, I think it's like a hundred and something degrees. It's like extremely hot. But if you guys live like, you know, the Texas and it's very hot. I've, yeah, just make sure to have like your air conditioning on. If you know someone who have like, you know, heat stroke problem, make sure to keep them cool down. Trust me, I know. Not the deal one during my school years. And it's not even fun, it's so scary. Let's see. Okay, I need to carefully open it up the packaging without damaging it. Because I need something to store away. Oh my god. 
come on, don't be a total. Mmm. Man, I still need to get like the Alien series for Treasure X. The Alien series looks cool. There we go. I already opened that part off. Now it's nice and carefully while damaging it. I already missed cutting this piece off. We're almost hitting 200 subscribers, thanks to some of you guys. And I said some because most of you guys are a bunch of, you know, jerks. So I already know how to deal with this, so put this out of the way. Grab. <sighs> Come on. How am I missing a lot of tape? I don't understand why the hell I'm missing tape. I'm missing to cut to this crap. Come on, don't, don't, don't dig with me. Oh, come on, why, why the hell are you punishing me? There we go, there we go. I'm just being a total jerk about it. We already seen, you know, the, the, the checklist of it, so it doesn't matter. Put the garbage out of the way. Grab the trade. All right, let's begin with the 10 levels of adventure. So, remove the tool, done. Now, of course, the X tool have the, you know, the, the blade, the scrape, the poke, and the, uh, I don't know what the hell that is, so. Make sure to put the uh, trade out of the way for now. Uh, discover your quest. So we'll see what quest are we gonna get, eh? So yeah, discovers our quest. Here it is. Of course, it's the same thing, so duh. So are we gonna get fire or we're we gonna get ice? Of course, because I have my own I have my own checklist, so who cares? Make sure okay. Peel open to to the top, so is, are we gonna get fire or are we gonna get ice? Make sure to have your plate with you in case thing goes bad. Ah, come on. Let's see what do we get? And I forgot the mint, and I forgot to get something. What I need? I need water. So remove this out of the way. And add water to erupt, so I forgot to get water. So, yeah, and I probably should put this right here on the plate in case something goes bad. All right, so I'll be right back. I need to get the water so I can put oh, yeah. this in. Okay, okay, I got the water in. I'm just now I just realized this is the worst idea I'm doing this again because I have two lamps with me. Uh, my background right here is made of papers. So I got water with me. This is stupid ideas I'm doing. Okay. Let's see what we got. Oh. I got fire! Yay! I finally got fire! Holy crap. This is so cool. I might need to turn on the fan for this. Damn, I finally fought, got fire. Now, if you guys remember, this is, I think this is like food for something. You know, something like, you know, activated with water. It is pretty cool. I want to know how they make it. If Moose Toys can, like, take me their, like, you know, their HQ and show me how to make it, I'll be happy. I'll be, I'll record everything and I'll be happy. God damn. Okay, I'm probably might need some sip walk. Oh, I think I poured too much water of it. Yeah, some of the food are so kind of wet. This is like real fake snow, but an orange. So this is like real fake lava. Pretty cool. Might need to, might need to wash this off. So here's the key, the exclusive key. I already painted my key, the one I got from Isor. So I might probably like, you know, grab another plate. So God, look at this foof. Okay, and I want to make sure none of it goes to my background photo, background wall. Let me get my uh 
So I'm going to foof out of here. Damn, I I think I would I think I already floated too much, so I'm gonna get the I probably need to get another plate, so grab this over here. Alright, I'm gonna pause again and grab it another plate. <laughs> alright, hurry, hurry. I got my other plate with me. Um and I got a sip block as well, so I can put the this one separated with the real fix now. I'm gonna put the key to the cipher now. And I'm getting the foof, some some of the foof on huh? my background. Oh god, you can see it's a smudge right here. Alright, so let's see. Level 4 and 5 is already finished. Level 6, peel off the ding. So hopefully we could get a gold crown. That is my main gold. And I wanted the treasure, the gold treasure. Let's open this. Yeah, come on. Stop being a dick. Yeah! Oh god, so hard to peel it off. So let's see, oh, it's water wax, not good. I hate water wax, so... I had to throw in mine, the blue one, because, you know, it's, it's nasty. And it's supposed to smell bad. Oh god, okay. Okay. Carefully, move this whole tire piece. A crap off here. Ugh. Okay. Put this right here. And put this right here as well. And look like I haven't got gold crown. God damn it. But who's this unknown character? Alright, so level 7 is to carve it. So I might need to bring the camera down, but I don't want to get the nasty wax smell on the tripod that I'm using. God, it's so... Okay, it's really smell bad. It smell like totally... Ugh. Come on. Don't... Don't dig with me. Alright, let's... So the way it works for this, you can, um... Slice it like... You know, like this, of course. Slice it. Scrape it up like this. Poke it. And of course, this, which scrape it. Yeah. But we're gonna use the knife, of course, because the knife is much better than the others. Okay, so we got the meteor out of here. Meteor full with nasty ass wax. Okay. Make sure to cut every single one of this crap out of this. Hopefully what figure do I get? I know what it I know I already seen it through because it's transfers okay. God it's so so nasty. Oh god. It's like doing surgery on it. Oh no dang oh, god. Okay, oh, come on. Scrape this. Nasty part off. Alright, this every treasure head treasure X hunter comes with their own main weapon that comes with a the figure, their own main weapon, and the exclusive staff it comes with. The question is, do I get real gold dip treasure? Okay, time to take the weapon off. Ooh, so like a Triceratop look. Make sure to grab every single one of these off. You need to do it nice and carefully without damaging the figure and the staff. God, it's so, this is so cool, but also disgusting at the same time because it's water wax. I want to know how the hell they make this. It looks cool, but why this stinks? Why the hell it stinks a lot? God damn it. Okay, make sure to scrape everything off. Remove the exclusive staff it comes with. Now for the figure, the hunter, of course. Oh god. So gross. Ugh. 
Come on, you bastard. Get out of this nasty. Ugh. Remove the rest of these disgusting. Okay, got some of the wax off. Okay, no wax in the hole, so. Okay, right, there we go. There we go. Figures off. Now, let's see. Level 8 is Crack the Meteor. Plug in the key. Open it up. Let's see what do we get. Go to treasure or not. Damn it. I didn't get any gold to treasure. Let's uh, try to move the gold treasure. Comes with. Oh god, it's so disgusting. Oh god, even the smell is bad enough. Ugh. Okay. So, I got everything out. So, I'm going to spoil it later, but first, I'm going to wash everything off with soap and water to get rid of this nasty smell. And probably throw away this water wax. Pretty much that's it, so... Yeah, I'll be right back, you guys. This smell is so disgusting. Alright, so I'm back. Gotta clean everything off with nasty wax and I have to throw it away. Jesus Christ. Okay, then. Well. Well, here's the character, what I got. So, the one. Let's see. Where. There's a checklist. My checklist I have. So the one I got looks like it's from the Gold Scorchers, and this one is a Triceratop, and it looks like I got is Bonfire. So yeah, let's take a look at Bonfire. Let's move everything out of the way. Zoom the camera a little bit. Make sure to focus on the camera. So here it is, Bonfire. What he looks like out of the out of this nasty wax smell. Ugh. Painting, sculpting, and detailing of this figure looks pretty good. You can see the different the 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 his hair fire right here, which is pretty cool. With some silver, black, of course, you know, for his his robe. And look like a magenta pink or something. I have no idea. You can see the nice detailing of his like you know, see the spines and everything. You can see he have like, you know, gold cool stuff right here. Um, Articulation-wise, his head can only can move left and right. Arms can go 36 degrees, but the weight, but because of the head is so big, it can barely move. This side right here on the right side can, but the other side can't. So that's kind of sucks. And both of the legs can move can move side to side like that, so you can get some, you know, some some pose, some pivot, some like motion. Uh, the weapon he comes with is this the triceratop looking head right here. Pretty cool looking on the you know the, with the sculpting and detailing of this one and his uh his and his Kuda staff his Kuda staff console compared to Isor staff compared to this it's different so yeah probably probably each hunter will probably have their own different staff or probably they will be the same I custom painted mine so yeah and the treasure that I got. Which is this. Put it right here. Wait, which one is facing? Ah, oh, it doesn't matter. I'll put it right here. And the treasure that I got is... Let's see. Is the Flame Star. So yeah, the Flame Star. So let's, um... Put it on what he looks like. So let's say put his weapon... Over there. Put it on his staff, so let's see. Put in his staff like that. Then you have to grab it down here. Crap. Yeah, he's gonna be having difficult standing up. Probably he could put his staff down here yeah it fits right 
All right, I probably need to stop the recording right now because it's going to go into the 20 minutes limit, so yeah. All right, so I guess this is what it looks like, what I swore. I mean, with the uh, bonfire, what it looks like holding the staff. Let me do some um, some size comparison. Here it is, size compared with, um, let's see. All right, here is size compared with Isor. Pretty cool. Here it is compared with Ray. I forgot his name now. Size compared with a grocery gain um, villain right here. This is taller. Here is compared with. Damn it. With Cole. I want to stand. Here it is compared with coal. Here it is compared with one of the MicroMasters Transformers MicroMasters. Almost the same size. Well, mine is this, of course. Almost the same size as the MicroMaster. And lastly, but not least, compared with Scorporos. So yeah. Damn it! I don't. I don't know what's wrong, why none of the figures doesn't want to stand. I'm just gonna bring the camera down like that. Well, to tripod. Down like that. Zoom out the camera. There we go. Overall, I think Bonfire is one of the coolest figures ever. I finally got my first, um, you know, fire hunter, so I'm pretty excited. So if you guys want to see the last video, which is Eyesore, go ahead and go to the... Is he on your computer? Go to the, uh, one of the... One of the sides here, here on the right side. And make sure to subscribe to my channel on the left side right here. On the left side. Or if you're on your phone, go to the uh, information symbol up there on the top right. So yeah. Uh, if you guys want to follow me, every social media I have. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, Steam, Discord, Torch, and Origin. And also Patreon. Look at the description down below. Damn it. And also, speaking of Patreon, now if you guys want to donate, don donate a dollar for Patreon, so you can see um, what stuff I can custom paint, what stuff what you need for custom painting your figure. Go right ahead and go check it out. Look at the description down below. So you guys already know the rules. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll tell next time. I'm out.